Greetings everybody, welcome to Fishing Planet. My name is The Lady and this is uh, the first part of a two part video that I'm doing about a Fishing Planet uh, introduction. As you can see right now I've uh, just logged on. Uh, it is with a completely new account and we're going to do the tutorial. So just uh, follow as it says. You uh, walk with the WASD and first off what we need to do is we need to cast our rod and we do that by clicking the left mouse button so that's what we're going to do now we wait for a fish to bite so as you can see uh, Fishing Planet is uh, it's looking uh, very nice for a fishing simulating game um, they're making also uh, Ah, <laughs> we need to wait a little longer it says and now we need to strike anyways what I was saying is that uh, Fishing Planet it is an uh, early access game uh, you can uh, you can uh, catch it on uh, Steam and it's uh, looking really nice and we just got ourselves our first fish which is a blue gill but we have to release it because we don't have anything yet that uh, can hold our fish so now we need to do uh, two more casts so we hit the left mouse button again. Fishing Planet uh, saw the first light of day in uh, August 2015. Uh, today it's uh, the end of April uh, 2016. Uh, so far there have been at least two big patches that uh, changed uh, the game uh, quite significantly. And uh, the last one of those uh, was uh, about a week ago. Um, and uh, because of that uh, um, you'll find a lot of tutorials online already about Fishing Planet but unfortunately um, especially the ones that were made prior to December they're uh, outdated so that's why I'm starting a new series of videos um, first off I'm doing this tutorial and then later on I'll also uh, do a leveling guide and in between I'll share you some tips and tricks about uh, how to fish and here it says that we don't have a fishing uh, fish net keeper and we're down to catching our last fish at least the last fish, uh, fish uh, on uh, on this spot uh, this lake over here it's uh, it's a lake that uh, you can't access uh, when you're starting well you can during this tutorial but once it's ended it's uh, you can't uh, reach this spot until you're level uh, 8 if I'm correct. Sorry if I've uh, not remembered it correctly, I'll uh, adjust it then later. Um, anyways, uh, but it's, uh, it looks really good, cool and uh, they're also uh, trying to implement uh, virtual reality uh, into this game. So uh, I can't wait to, uh, to try that out and see uh, what uh, fishing is like uh, then because it's going to be a whole different ball game and well, I started to play this game uh, actually about a month ago, and uh, um, well, it really uh, has me hooked ever since. So here we have our third fish of the day, which is the bluegill. It's a two on the gram fish, about 20 centimeters, and it gives us free experience points. But we have to release it, and now it says that we're um, it's time for uh, the real catch. So we have to press the I button. By pressing I, we're opening our inventory, and now it wants us to change bait. We're currently using bread, but now we need to use red worms. So we're going to do that. We also need to go to the local shop. Whenever you're at a lake, you can go to a shop, and when you're home, there's uh, the big store, which you can go to and uh, shop uh, as you like. So we need to go to tools and equipment. It's right here. Just follow the arrow and we are forced to buy ourselves a fish uh, stringer, the fish gel it's called. So we're going to buy that and now that we have purchased it we need to go back to the map just as we're doing so and we were currently on this spot but right now we need to go to this spot. So we're going there, go fishing. We have to walk down uh, down the pier. 
So here we go. It's some nice looking flowers. And we have the Casa Bay near the lily pads. And as you can see, it's right there. So we hit the left button once again. But uh oh, something has changed. Uh, the depth here is uh, lower than the place uh, we uh, we fished in uh, fished on earlier. So we have to change uh, the setting. And in this particular case, uh, the line of our leader. And by doing so, we need to press the O and the P button. We press the P button. We add more line to it, and by pressing the O button. We are making uh, the bower go lower. We have to reach the 50 centimeters, which is right there. And now we can do a recast on the same spot. And there we go. And now it's... Uh, all we need to do is wait until uh, we see some action. And there's already a visitor who's eager to get itself a worm. Almost there. And this one does take its sweet time. Don't think it's uh, just happening in a tutorial. <laughs> it also happens uh, after we finish this, uh, when you progress through the levels. But there it is. So we caught our first trophy. And because we have fish net, or a fish gel stringer actually, we can keep it. So trophy fish are uh, one of those fishes that are, uh, well, sort of rare. Um, there are certain times a day that you can fish and you can catch a trophy by the bunch. So they're not really that rare anymore. But still, uh, as you can see here, trophy fish most of the time are a bit bigger than the, the regular uh, species. This one is uh, a little over 400 grams. It's 28 centimeters and it gives us 33 experience points. and. That's uh, why catching a trophy is always nice, it gives you more XP. So we're going to keep that one. Alright. Now we need to go back to the map, it says. And we are going home. Yes, you want to leave. Here. <coughs> Excuse me. Now here are the results of today. We got ourselves a black trophy. At, um, it's uh, six... Uh, bucks that we got and it also uh, because we leveled up we got ourselves three coins and a total of 44 experience so here we go the overview of today the total results and we also got the daily bonus as you can see right here and the daily bonus it uh, allows us uh, uh, every time you log on every single day that you log on in, in a row you get a bonus and if you do it for five days in a row, instead of getting the normal currency, you're getting col uh, the gold currency. And that's uh, like a premium money. You can also purchase it by um, spending real money on it. And there are a couple of other ways, but I'll discuss those later. Anyways, happy days for us right now. Here we'll see some uh, information. You'll get these pop-ups in the uh, game as well. And you can also find them right there in the booklet uh, symbol. So the bigger the fish keeper, the more we can uh, can keep at the end of the day. And there's some more information. You can read it for yourself uh, when you're doing the tutorial. And as you can see here, we are now level up. And we have ourselves three coins extra. And we also got our basic pack. Now, I still don't know to this day uh, what it actually uh, <laughs> uh, involves, because whenever I go my, to my inventory, which is uh, right here, um, and I go to something like this, uh, I don't see anything in here that would explain what's in the pack. So I'm just going to assume, uh, assume that it's this stuff, well, we already had the red worms on us and the bread, 
heard that we also got some line right now and a hook number 10, a hook number 8 and a hook number 6 so uh, that's uh, the tutorial for right now um, I'll explain more stuff later and in the second video I'll be going over each one of these icons and explain to you what they all mean and bye bye tight lines <laughs>